Hey guys, Redstone here. So today we're gonna take a quick look at the Trinus 3D printer. Uh, and here it is with the all of its glory. As you can see, I just bought a tripod, so it um so it's a little different of a setup, but it's pretty cool. Uh, stabilizes the camera, so that's pretty cool. But as you can see, uh, this is a Trinus 3D printer. Um, now I have my iPad light on it, uh, because you could not really see it, but this is my first impressions of this printer. Now, what do I like and what I don't like about it so far? I'm gonna do a review on it once I, um, you know, get more prints off of it. So, my favorite part about this printer so far is how durable it is. I'm not saying that, but this thing is steel. I swear, this thing is so, so, so heavy duty. Also, another thing I like about it is that it's um, it's very inexpensive for what the machine is. Uh, so, that's pretty nice. But, there is a couple concerns I have with this printer. First, I cannot find the software anywhere. I've checked everywhere. I tried Repetier. Oh, God, sorry about that. My tripod just fell over. But... Refocus it. Okay, but the problem was that uh, I couldn't I couldn't find the software for this printer uh, And I still cannot find it. So if you guys can please leave it in the link in the uh, In the comment section that would really help me and it would help the review get out faster Because I've not been able to print anything besides the sample print on there. So it prints very well I would say it probably prints in the ballpark of a I would say probably, if I had to guess, maybe the, uh, the mono price back there that has a bigger bill volume, but then again, this is a lot more compact. Now, for the size, you might be wondering, is this thing light or heavy? It is heavy, I'm telling you. This thing is probably as heavy as two Ultimakers. Um, that's how heavy it is. Very, very heavy. But that's also a good thing. Another thing I kind of don't like about it is that it's very noisy. Now, it's not that noisy, it's just pretty noisy. It's, it's like, it's not like noisy, noisy. It's just like, kind of like noisy, uh, if you know what I'm saying. I probably just got spoiled from the Ultimaker 2 go being super, super quiet. But, yeah, uh, now you receive the package by a kit, and basically what happens is, refocus right there, you get four of these identical pillars. I put it apart, I mean... In about an hour which is a very good timing so yeah so an hour uh, to assemble it and it works fantastic uh, some of the instructions were a little confusing about where the board supposed to go and stuff but besides that it was a really good easy build uh, so yeah if you're interested in buying one of these I'm gonna do a review in about a week um, I mean it's a fantastic printer. Uh, I haven't had any problems with it. Uh, it prints really well. It's very cheap. So I don't know. Uh, it's your guys' choice on that. Uh, but I'm going to make a lot more uh, printing videos. And a lot more uh, 3D printing videos. I'm also going to start up a channel uh, with um, gaming. Gaming related. And people are asking me. Isn't that going to deter away from your main channel? And that's actually a great question. No, it's not. I'm going to have time for both of the channels combined like i'm thinking on the gaming channel i'll just post two videos on the weekend that's it um so i won't be consistent on that channel this channel i'm 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 making a video about every day so um again you guys are amazing uh keep up the great support and yeah i hope you enjoy this video my first video with a tripod and my first video really with um the trinus so i hope you guys enjoy this video and hope you have a great day Bye.